I made some mistakes when I was younger and wound up spending 10 years in jail. When I got out, the only ones there for me were my pit bulls. Now it's my turn to rescue them. My name is Shorty Rossi, and I am the Pit Boss. All you guys do is give me <laughs> but that's the way I have to be. What are you talking about, Ashley? Being... I was left in charge, so you have to listen to me. That's the way it is. You can still be the boss. I don't get that. What the hell? What are you doing here? What is going on? They're not listening. What do you mean? When I got a phone call from Sebastian telling me that Ashley wouldn't let them go on a rescue, I knew something was really wrong. I made my tour early because I had to go back to Shortywood and making sure that my business wasn't going down the drain. She can't even rationalize for two seconds. She can't even listen to what we call her. That's why I came back early, because no one giving me damn communication of what's going on in my office. At the same time, you're not even calling me and returning my calls. I'm then I get a call from Sebastian street. saying that you're not allowing them to go on dog rescue. You know what? This. I don't want to deal with it right now. We'll talk about it later. You get in my office. Oh my God. I am so worried that he's not going to leave me in charge ever again. And that I'm going to go back to being the receptionist. Oh, you are a pain in the ass. Sit down. Did you know Shorty was supposed to come in today? No, I had no idea he was going to come in today. What the f is going on? I come back early and I'm in a disarray. Ever since you left, they just keep disobeying me. They don't listen. I mean, they walked out on a gig this week, and then they what walked out. What do you mean they out walked out on a gig? For their premiere. We were in the middle of a gig that was paying three times as much as we normally get paid, and they couldn't stay five more minutes to finish the gig, and I had to step in. I can understand if Ronald and Sebastian left a gig early to go save a pit bull, but that wasn't the case. They left a gig early to go to the premiere, and that was unacceptable. They're not going to cancel the red carpet if you're a few minutes late. Why don't you tell me this when I'm on the Road. That's your problem with the communication. If they're not listening to you, I get a call from Seb. I don't like it when there's a pit bull rescue and you're arguing with them about not going on a job. I don't, I don't think they respect the fact that you left me in charge, honestly. I had to tell Ashley, even though you're doing a great job here at Shortywood, the number one priority is not the entertainment gigs. It's the pit bulls. I don't care who's right, who's wrong. You're wrong and they're wrong. That's it. Ain't gonna go back to normal. I'm back. So I have to go back in there with them? Oh, what, you think you're gonna Stay in here in my office? No, get your out of my office so I can reorganize back to my face. I'm really embarrassed right now because I have to go back in the bullpen and sit next to Ronald and Seb. It's gonna be so sickening to me. Like, it's uncomfortable and awkward. Like, ugh. I guess that's what happens when you're not fair to people. Goes around, comes around. Ronald and Seb are like proud that Shorty's back. They're almost gloating in my face. I'd be happy if I never had to talk to Ronald and Seb again.